much for coming along this evening. It's really great to see so many of you. And we're here this evening to officially open our Construction Skills Centre. And in a few minutes, I will be formally introducing our speaker for this evening. And the person who's going to um, pull the string, or we've just been trying to work out which string, um, is so that you can see the plaque. But thank you so much to everyone for coming along. I'd like to welcome some of our um, special guests. You're all special, but some of our special guests I'd like to officially welcome. But a very special welcome to our special guest this evening, who is Martin Clark, uh, Regional Managing Director of Lure Homes. Um, and Martin has kindly agreed to come along this evening to unveil the plaque and uh, say a few words about this facility. And two or three weeks ago, Martin actually came round to have a little look. And I was really delighted when Martin said that some of the work that he was seeing was really industry standard. So that's fantastic. And I know that's nice for Brian to know that. Brian's the curriculum manager for this area. So watch out, future house building. We probably have some builders amongst our mist. And certainly we'll have um, these likely lads over here are going to be our carpenters, I think, aren't you? Carpenters, yeah, yeah, okay, good. Before I ask Martin to unveil the plaque, I just wanted to, to let you know a little bit about the education and training which Newbury College offers to the construction industry. As you probably know, and those of you who um, look at what sort of industries there are in Berkshire, um, the construction industry is one of the largest industries in this particular area, and it employs many thousands of people. In about 2005, uh, Newby College started to develop construction programmes and it's really from that base that we started to think about we must have a new centre which meets the needs of the construction industry and will help our students to get the kind of training that they need to, uh, which is an industry standard. So it's now time, less from me and more, me. <laughs> <laughs> and more from Martin when I walk off with his nose. Yeah, that's right, thank you. And then when Martin's finished and, and we're ready to pull the cord when we get the right one, um, then after that, then uh, Nick Carter, who's the chairman of College Governors, um, is also the chief executive of West Berkshire Council, is going to just say a thank you to everybody. So I'll pass over to Martin Clark. So thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, thank you, Anne, and uh, good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. Um, I was delighted to be invited to open the new construction facilities at Newbury College on behalf of Law Homes, because I know what a difference a high quality home or an office or even a training facility can make to an individual and to an entire community. At Bloor Homes, we see every day how well-planned spaces can transform people's lives. Somewhere better to eat, somewhere better to sleep, somewhere better to work and learn. Your surroundings, the way uh, they look, feel and function can make a big difference. They can all make the difference. So what makes a high quality space? We believe it's three things. High quality design, high quality materials, and high quality construction. And the key to all of those things is high quality people. Especially bright new talent like apprentices and graduates, and the teachers and tutors who nurture first class skills and pass on experience to the next generation waiting to join the construction industry. Together, students and teachers alike, you need to keep raising the standards and take pride in the work you do. The expertise of people, our people, their individual care and attention to detail, that's what makes a Bloor house a Bloor home. And that's why we value them. We invest in their skills and we, we reward their achievements. Um, when I joined Bloor Homes 26 years ago, I was a trainee, an apprentice, if you like. I worked hard and I worked my way up. I moved around the business, learning different skills until I arrived at where I am today, the Managing Director for Bloor Homes. And now I'm proud to represent a local developer and a local employer. For us, it's extremely exciting that the local talent we wish to attract 
may no, no, sorry, may no longer have to leave the area to gain those first class skills we're looking for. With nationally recognised accredited training and qualifications, valuable links to employers, and now this fully equipped training facility, Newbury College will play an even more prominent role in giving bright, new talent a valuable platform to explore their potential. It can make all the difference to their future. And whilst it's not been easy in the construction industry over recent years, there's so much opportunity for people with the drive and commitment to find an interested and varied career. High quality tradesmen such as carpenters and bricklayers can and do progress to become senior managers and directors within the industry. And with Newbury College as their foundation, there's no reason why they can't go all the way in what is such a diverse and interesting worldwide industry. Thank you. Thank you. Good afternoon everyone, just a few words for me, Anne has said a great deal already and I'm not going to, uh, <laughs> oh, a great deal more to add, uh, Anne always goes first and uh, has the... Uh, Deliberately. <laughs> absolutely, I just want to say a couple of things before, uh, just thank you for coming. First of all, um, I know many of you came to the opening of the sports hall a few weeks ago, but if you haven't had the opportunity, assuming Anne and the team will let you move that way, it's, do take the opportunity to have a look at the whole building because actually this is great, the construction side, but the sports hall and what's upstairs are equally impressive as well. So do take the opportunity to have a look at the whole facility, which I think is not just an asset for the college, but is also an asset for the local community as well. So if you haven't had that opportunity, please take the time to do so. It also seemed very fitting to me that we're opening a construction centre here at the college, literally at the door of what will probably be one of Newbury's biggest housing developments over the next few years at Sandford. Uh, and one of my hopes is that actually the people who train here and get the experience here hopefully will have the opportunity to put those skills into practice uh, as hopefully we start to see construction pick up in Newbury and more houses built in, around Newbury which is going to be the centre for much of the district's expansion in the years to come. Uh, my primary purpose of standing up here is to say thank you and I'd like to start by saying thank you to the management team and Bill in particular. I know many people have been involved in bringing this together but for the uh, corporation, for the governors, the management team are particularly important and have helped us, I think, taken us along this road to, to actually see this uh, facility up and running here today. So thank you for all the hard work that team's put in, in to make it open on time and make it open within budget. I think a major achievement. And finally, my thanks to Martin. Martin, thank you very much for taking the time out to uh, come and see what facility we've got here. Let's hope that we can provide many of the future employees of your firm and see things really move forward. But thank you all very, very much. It's